so let's say we have some himalayan cold winds blowing from the north so we would say that we have a cold north wind which means the wind is coming from the north which implies the direction of wind itself is towards south so if we say that we have a southeastern wind that means the wind is coming from southeast so direction of wind actually will be northwestern so it should be like this so this is a major confusion among students that the southeastern wind so they take the wind direction like this and they don't get their answers so when we say southeastern wind it is coming from southeast so it's going towards northwest so the direction of the wind is towards northwest so now this is the wind direction and it's making phi angle with the equator and the ship is traveling towards right with the, let's say velocity vs we need to find the wind velocity with respect to ship so velocity of wind with respect to ship is velocity of wind minus velocity of ship and if the angle between them is phi the the vector sum of vw and minus vs will be this and its value will be magnitude will be vw square plus vs square plus 2 vw vs cos phi because phi is the angle between vw and minus vs let me just write it in vector form so this is the magnitude of our wind in second part is asking the direction the wind makes with respect to ship so this is the direction of the wind with respect to ship and this is the direction of ship so he is asking for angle this phi dash so you can see tan phi dash is this height upon this length so this height is vw sin phi and this width is vs plus vw cos phi so you put the values and you can get your numerical answer as well